it is. Wait. Oh, this. this is Psycho Xian Charles. On my right is Xian Kumo. On my left is Sensei Larry. And we are going to do Technique of the Week. Today's Technique of the Week features Shihan Kumo. He's going to show you defense against a right punch and a left punch. And he's going to show you how to put people to sleep. No further ado, let's get to it. Us! Us! These are sleeper holes. Okay, so most of the time you can put the sleeps, somebody to sleep in about 15 seconds. If you go any longer than like 25, he's probably not going to wake up. Okay, so 15 seconds, or you can just do hold him until he taps out, which you'll know because his body will just go limp. Okay, and there's a tremendous amount of pressure that goes on that. But the opening is everything. Okay, so if he jabs, I'm here. Now, I do not have to be behind him. That's the first movement. Second movement is I'm here and I bring him this way, see it? Now I grab, and that's it. And now I have him. And once I put and bury my head, and I put that pressure on, I hold it for 15 seconds, and he's going out. Okay, watch again. My first move is, is the blocking, okay? Now I'm here, I don't have to get behind. I just have to bring my hand to my ear. So when I come around here, see, I will bring it to my ear. Now the sleeper hold is on. And there's not a damn thing you can do to stop it, except stop breathing. Understand what I'm doing here. The pressure is on stopping the blood supply here. So that pressure is stopping that blood supply. Now, if you look at my other back hand, I'm pushing the head this way. And at the same time, I'm pulling against that, that artery and I'm cutting the blood, blood flow off. You okay? Yeah. About 15 to 20 seconds. He'll be out. <laughs> yeah, and after he goes limp, let him go, because he will die. The second, uh, choke hold is he's firing off the rear hand. Again, I don't do anything fancy. Okay, and, and the entrance is everything. His hands are up. He throws that punch. It's here, see it? I don't have to do nothing. Okay, I didn't do a hard block. I didn't have to do anything. But once I get up to this point, he's mine. Okay, watch the right. Watch the right hand now. Here, boom. See the right hand? actually hitting that neck, see it? I'm hitting that spot. Okay? And then I'm gonna add to it. So that's the first two movements. But it's all it's all real quick. Now I'll do the third one. Okay, so it's here. Oh, so I'm right here. There's that artery. I'm gonna use his arm for leverage. And now I'm gonna put the pressure on. See it? He gets one breath and that's it. And this is how quick it is. Yeah. See it? He's already mine. Nothing wrong, I don't like going to the ground unless I know there's only one person. I can put him to sleep the same way by standing up. But if for some reason he's real strong or something and he wants to go to the ground, it's like, welcome to my world. Okay? Because I like the ground too but not when there's more than one person. So when he throws that punch, boom, right here. Now I lock in. Now, he can't move like very my head. He can't move, he's not gonna do nothing. This time, I am gonna go to the ground. There's nobody else but him. So this time I will go to the ground. So from here, I'm straight here. Now what I'm going to do is as I put, I'm going to cork, uh, corkscrew to the ground. As I do, the pressure will increase. Once I hit the ground, he will never be able to move me because I'm going to sit in an area, I'm going to sit so he can't move it. And I'm just going to bring him corkscrew down. 
Once I sit this way, you cannot move. If I was up on my hip, he could move me. But once I'm here, he can't move me. Try to get loose. He ain't gonna do nothing. Try to hit me with your elbow. He can't do nothing. He's only got 15, 20 seconds before he's out. Try to move. Try to get out of it. He's not gonna do anything. He can't. And you gotta remember, he's using energy. He can't breathe. I cut the blood supply off. He's gonna go to sleep. And that's our technique of the week. We will be doing them pretty much weekly. And also, just to give you guys a heads up out there, we're gonna start doing a Sento Shin Academy where people can subscribe online. And uh, Shian Kumo and I will teach classes online on a subscription basis. And we'll make it very affordable. But uh, if you decide to subscribe, be ready to train. All right. Oof. Oof.